Hey guys, it's Species Sims, and we are back with more of Batman, the Telltale game. A Telltale game, but Batman! Batman! Anyway, so we're going to uh, resume where we left off, which he was just walking out into what looks like a uh, party to, uh, you know, a fundraising party for Harvey Dent. Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. And even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Now, for too long, this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. Oh, aren't you just lovely? If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would... Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Of course. Say hi, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. Uh. Hi, Bruce. <laughs> I tee him up and he knocks him down. That's how Mr. Wayne and I do business. Thank <laughs> Enjoy you. my Thank wine. You it's expensive. What a douchey support. thing to say. What a douche-tastic thing to say. Together, we will change Gotham. I should have done that just to be. I should have had him be like, I like the thrill. Enjoy my wine. I'm a douche. I should have just made him the biggest Mr. douche Wayne, in the universe. Thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. Uh, so the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Relax. It was important. Not more than this. Dude, I, know you despise I will take my money back, bitch. Told, I do too. What, a chance to show off your teeth and talk about yourself to a room full of money? Say it ain't so. It's called playing the game, Bruce. And tonight, you have noticed, I'm playing for City Hall. Playing no a big game there, Harvey. To see me. You want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. I'll do anything for Gotham. It's my home. It's our home. I'm doing it for Gotham. I mean, this will help you too, Doing Bruce. it for Gotham, Harvey. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, Handsome. you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always uh, makes me sound like a used car salesman. Which, for the record, I was in law school. <laughs> so right, late. Right, right. How about uh, put a dent in crime? Because we're going to. You. That's not that bad. I'm going to use that. Because we're Bruce legit going to end up putting Harvey Dent Together, into crime. You and so. me, we Maybe. change Gotham. Foreshadowing. A city free from crime. Spoiler alert. Can play in the streets again. That's what I want to. For anyone who's never seen a Batman movie in their life. Like we have to shake things up to make or the comic. Well, or you can start with a few hands. Hmm? Come on. All right, but I draw the line at kissing babies, Harvey. Ooh, our house is swank. I like this. <gasps> hey, is that Catwoman? I'm just taking a guess here. You know she's going to show up and like... And he's going to be like, I know those eyes. That guy looks thrilled, doesn't he? Eyes? Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. Wait, if you believe in Dent, Harvey's introducing him to someone that works for him? How After stupid all, can he be? Whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. Tonight's not well, about Harvey. You. Everything's but about we're us for Batman. Tonight because we want to make a difference, and I'm that's Batman. what it's going to take. Every single one of us. I just not just me, not just Mr. Dent. <laughs> Everyone. Right, right. Of course. Old families like ours should flock together. You know, like birds. I like birds. You're preaching, dear. I really no, wish true. we could answer every question or everything the comment with Gotham. I'm Batman. Why, this city's luster I'm dated Batman. years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall. 
That Cape Bat Freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. It is the wild goddamn West. Regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. More than you've and done. It's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. I'd say it all depends on the man. Sometimes you need a person who will go off script. Such as dressing up in a bat costume? And taking out the criminals who ruin our city. Though the cape may be a bit much. <laughs> and don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility <laughs> to Arkham help is Gotham's dangerously. most at-risk individuals. Unsecure. Everybody gets out we'll of it all the time. dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. To you know, all your parents did for this city. Oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway. It was too terrible. soon, lady. Truly terrible. Too soon. Uh, a tragedy like that at such a young age <laughs> must have been crippling. That's why I dress up like a bat. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment. Maybe. Uh, well, I notice I never talk about Harvey because fuck Harvey. And I'm sure you don't either. Uh, yes, well, that was a long time ago. My Fuck Harvey. <laughs> it's about me. I'm Batman. <laughs> of course. Together, we'll help the whole city move on. He's like, hi. Hi, it's about me. Uh, not how I pictured that going. All right, I'll right pip you up next I'm time. I'm picturing another drink. You know, I was kind of hoping you would mention my campaign. Or at least my name. Oh, quit being a bitch. And now I'm picturing that drink, too. All right, next time. Oh, well, hello. Let me guess. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor. <laughs> Selena Kyle. Eager to know you. Vicky Vale. Oh, not no. interested. And reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private oh. fundraiser, Miss Vale. Why is she blonde? No reporters allowed. <laughs> Why is well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whenever you want um, at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, I'm here for Mr. Wayne. Tonight is strictly off the record. We can talk. But nothing gets written down. I'm okay with that. I was just hoping to see what makes Bruce Wayne tick. Watches. This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now. It's so formal. Call me Bruce. Well, <laughs> I can bed you later. You've been going around teasing everyone tonight. But how are you doing? I'm here to support Harvey! Before all the champagne runs out. Everyone loves the host. You're king for a day. Just a day? <laughs> None of those were I good answers. Guess Bruce Wayne has that feeling year round. Yeah, well, I take nights and weekends off. Mr. Wayne, you've, you've got something on your collar. Um, is that blood? Yeah. It looks like. Oh, this? No, it's nothing. It's just, uh,. Cut myself shaving. What? Your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Kidding. God, oh, Harvey, if your neck got any fatter, it'd be bigger stuff? than your head. Another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this Uh huh. Shit. You're looking Excuse shady, us, Harvey. Sir. You looking shade shade. Look at him, he's like, whatever. I don't give a flying fuck. And what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham for all of us. But at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. Jesus, Harvey, inviting a known criminal to your fundraiser? In my house? Exactly look good for your squeaky clean image. Let me worry about that. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. He's so cute. Especially when he looks at him like, what, Harvey? You know, I've been I'm giving you in his eyes. It's house. adorable. Decent walk up, sky high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Though the decor offends my eyes. <laughs> Man, all flash, no class. Well, you couldn't afford it. 
Yeah, right. I'm the richest man in this world. I'm Batman, damn it. Come on, Falcone. <laughs> Thank you for welcoming me into your home. You're gonna leave if you keep dissing my house. You're oh. a respectable man, I hear. All right, Bruce I don't want to do it. I know who you are. The guy who's gonna sell me his house. Your guests will remember Gentlemen, that. Perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. That's not good. There was no good outcome, though. You shake his hand, the guests are like, mm, shady business. You don't, you he's like, know, I'm gonna Mr. fucking Falcone, kill you. My analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill. At hey, what's... Private audience. Oh, come on, guys. Yeah, now you look make Bruce, Bruce Wayne look stupid. You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. Seen and not heard. Whatever you... Uh, uh, what did I say? Thumbs up, yo. I don't like this. Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And no. I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just say it he will. Unlike most people I've met, Harvey actually has integrity. Harvey He's trying to make that. Gotham a better place. So he doesn't so kill I. us later. So will you. Hey, we all carry this city on our broken backs. Might lighten the load if we do so together. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me a Gotta digestion. hate them. I got enough of that as is. <laughs> I don't like so, this dude. Can we just kill him and get a relationship? Over? I don't want a relationship with you, buddy. Chalk this for me. Here, pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Whatever of course he noticed that he caught it. Gracious host. Okay, imagine this is me. Phil Cody These noticed are that. All he caught my it. Friends Hope he noticed Gotham. it. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. All my friends, yeah. People that you're. I make them all move. And I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Look, I'm only talking to you because Harvey asked, trusting a friend to know what's best for Gotham. Now that's a predicament. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand the situation. Money gets money. We're in such the a tight spot. The alliances, the hidden costs. Oh, we're dead. Your father knew which hands to shake. I shook your hand outside. And which to break. Whatever you say. You're a good kid. You look like him, you know? It's nice that we understand each other. I don't want to get murdered by this no neck. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Hey, I appreciate the hospitality, Mr. Wayne. But I, uh... <laughs> I don't think I'll put an offer on the house. A nice guy like you should have a nice place to live. I'll be seeing you, Bruce. While this city's still standing. Uh... We're so fucked. We are so fucked. I'm serious, we're fucked, man. Um, that was a really great way to open the series. Um, and boop. I'm trying to like pause it, but it doesn't pause while it's loading, so it's really annoying. Boop. Aha, there we go. Perfect. Anyway, so these are gonna be like really short parts apparently, because it has perfect 15 minute intervals. Um 
So I suppose I could do them longer and we could do like more 30 minute parts, but you know, tee hee hee. Anyway, so I know that this isn't too long of a game, but yeah, so anyway, I'm going to wrap this part up here. I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.